Well, here we are. The new Vitoku 2 Sprint Run. Sandlot construction. You can faintly see that lamination line right there. Vitoku 2, the uh, FRN on this guy right here. Man, it's got a really cool, like, dark denim blue color to it. Now, the super blue that came out, you know, what, almost four years ago, that had a much paler colored blue. This right here is a much more darker blue. I would call it like a denim blue. Really cool, man. Itoku 2, and then there's the laminate right there. 410, SUS 410. Pretty cool, man. A few gripes uh, out of the box. They didn't sharpen it all the way back to the Ricasa right there. Kind of a bummer, whatever. I can either sharpen it all the way back myself or I can just put a choil there. No big deal. Uh, pocket clip, you can see out of the box there. A little loose. Again, no big deal. Just pull out your bit driver. Make sure you got the right size there. Coop, that's what I'm looking for. Yeah, you know, it's uh, action. If you're not used to these things, you know, they're a little stiffer than you're gonna find on your paramilitary stuff like that. Also, you're gonna have sharp edges right here. There's no detent, it's just a lock spring that holds it back through there. Uh, some people have a hard time flicking these out, and so they'll do where they just ride the thumb stud all the way out, but if you build up enough pressure and put your fingers over here, that's not a big deal. Let that puppy fly. And you can also get the middle finger flick as well. Yeah, really cool knife. Out of the box edge. You know, it just feels like this stuff can get really sticky. It's a little bit furry right here, a little bit of a burr on there, no big deal. Uh, you can see just a little bit of frillies on there. Not a big deal at all. We'll just take this strop here, one micron strop. Make sure it's cleaned off there. Just give it a few passes here on the strop. And if that doesn't work, we'll just jump over this ultra fine. But we got to load it up with one of these compounds here, one micron in size. Let's see what that does for us here on the paper. A little bit better, a little bit better, you know. I think we'll just kind of come on here nice and gentle. Set that guy aside. Let's see what I got now. There we go. That's more what I'm looking for. Yeah, good stuff, man. So that's just kind of a first look there. I just want to show you guys what I kind of do out of the box when I first get my knives. Just kind of check them out. Uh, as far as the edge on there, it's uh, what they do with every factory knife is they try to give you the best blend, best compromise between super polished and super toothy. They try to give you a blend of both so that they satisfy everybody. But I think for a steel like Vitoku 2, probably one of the better things to do is to go ahead and polish it out with a 4,000 grit water stone. This is a Japanese water stone. It's got a uh, vitrified bond, and we're going to be checking that out in another video, so that should be really cool. So stay tuned, guys. Good stuff. Good stuff ahead. We'll see uh, how this steel kind of rates, because we don't know yet. Yeah, so far, man, it seems like it can get super sticky sharp, and I'm pretty excited about that. This is going to be probably more of a steel that you're going to want to polish out, you know, uh, so I'm pretty stoked about that. So yeah, I'm stoked. We're going to tune this guy up. I'm going to test it out, carry it around, see what I think of it. I think I'm going to put that 4K edge on there, see what I think. And yeah, we'll just kind of go from there, boys. Uh, look at your uh, favorite knife retailers for these to drop. These are a sprint run. They're also going to do the Delica, Man Bug, Dragonfly, Ladybug. All those knives are usually you always start with the Endura. So if you want an Endura, you better get one now. And uh, River's Edge Cutlery. That sounds like a... Uh, one of the kind of low-key places you can probably go and pick one up without too much of a of a crowd, too much of a rush. And those should be dropping right now. So, right on, dudes. Take it easy.